tips for successful treatment. Dentists who wish to provide patients with efficient and quality care must be correctly equipped. CAVO has further developed the use of airscaler technology through continued research. Newly developed tips have opened up new treatment possibilities for the dental surgeon. The technology is based on the CAVO Multiflex coupling with the CAVO Airscaler Sonic Flex 2000L or alternatively the 2000N. Stand-alone equipment is no longer necessary since all tips fit directly to the CAVO Sonic Flex easily, safely and quickly. For CAVO, innovation means providing the dentist with efficient systems which are easy to use. The main problem with the retrograde root canal preparation is the need to approach the apices by removing the overlying buccal bone. This reduces dramatically the available access for instrumentation. The Sonic Flex retro tips have been designed with ease of use and minimal bone removal in mind. There are four tips in the set with different sizes according to the size of the root canal and the angulation required to access the root for an optimal retrograde root filling in axial direction. There are four matching undercut preparation instruments and two condensing hand instruments for the efficient obturation of the root canal. The Sonic Flex retro tips are easily attached to the Cavo Sonic Flex. A connector is attached to the Sonic Flex to enable the delivery of sterile solutions to cool the tip during operation. The tubing is attached, the Sonic Flex retro tip screwed onto the Sonic Flex, and the treatment may commence. We are showing clinical examples using the new Sonic Flex retro tips on an upper incisor, an upper premolar and a lower molar. In the first example, a tooth requires an apicectomy and a retrograde root filling. The preparation of the retrograde cavity is achieved with Sonic Flex retro tips. A local anesthetic is administered. Wherever possible, a vescoconstrictor should be used to obtain a clear working field and adequate analgesia that is 1 to 80,000 adrenaline. In our example, a buccal infiltration is used. To reduce gingival recession of the crown tooth, a semilunar rather than a full mucoperiosteal flap is raised. Removal of the buccal apex of the root tip is achieved with a rosehead burr using continuous coolant irrigation, taking care not to damage the neighboring anatomical structures. Due to the small dimension of the Sonic Flex retro tip, the amount of bone removal can be reduced as only a 6 mm diameter access is effectively required. Curettage of the apical issues. Notice the small buccal opening, which does not have to be enlarged during the resectioning or retrograde preparation. Resection of the root apex with a flat fissure burr. The correct preparation tip is chosen according to the quadrant and size of the root tip. Introduction of the Sonic Flex Retro Preparation Tip. 
the correct level of sterile coolant irrigation is determined. Control of the egg shield angulation of the tip. After location of the canal entrance at the anatomical apex, the retrograde cavity is prepared with a filling action. During preparation, the retro tips should only be used with light pressure as this produces the optimal cutting action. The tip is routinely checked to ensure that the diamond coating is not clogged with debris as this may affect the efficiency of the cutting action. The depth of the cavity must be at least 3 mm. This can be checked since the diamond coating on the tip is 3 mm long. The respective tip to produce the necessary undercut is chosen. The tip is rotated in a circular fashion circumferentially within the apical portion of the canal to ensure an adequate groove is prepared. This is then tested with an angled probe, for example a Briot probe. After achieving hemostasis and a dry apical field, the retrograde cavity is dried with air or paper points. Observation of the retrograde preparation with a micromirror. The root canal is filled with a suitable material which is independent of the preparation technique. Finally, the mucoperiosteal flap is closed and compressed for one minute. The surgical wound is then closed with a suture to allow healing by primary intention. The preoperative radiogram reveals a radiolucent area overlying the apex of the tooth suggestive of a radicular cyst. The retrograde filling with a length of 3 mm is observed in the post-operative radiograph. In a similar fashion, a root resection of tooth is undertaken. The initial semilunar incision is made. The mucoperiosteal flap is raised. The mesial root is exposed and the distal root. Resection of both the mesial and the distal root apices and enucleation of the pathological tissue. Retrograde preparation of the mesiolingual and the mesiobuccal canal is undertaken together with the distal canal. Preparation of the retention of mesiolingual, buccal and distal canals. The canals are dried with paper points and filled with a retrograde root canal filling material. The hand instruments are used to condense the material into the cavity. Control of the retrograde root filling. Pre and post operative bite wing radiographs. Similarly, the tooth is prepared for a retrograde root canal filling.
The diamond coating of the Sonic Flex Retro Tips ensures the cavity can be prepared with good control and efficiency. For the retention of the majority of the retrograde filling materials, an undercut should be prepared. Because of their small size, the tips not only allow greater control, but also minimize the removal of bone to gain access to the apex of the root. The controlled preparation of roots is possible for both upper and lower molar teeth due to the angulation of the Sonic Flex Retro Tip. Using the new preparation instruments, the retrograde root canals can be prepared to an adequate depth of 6 mm. The necessary cooling of the retro tip is achieved by irrigation with sterile solutions. The hand instruments match the respective preparation instruments, which allows for greater accuracy and control during the application of the material. This ensures optimal condensation of the retrograde filling material and produces restorative margins of a high quality. The use of Cavo Sonic Flex retro tips and the accompanying hand instruments represents a simplification of retrograde preparation and increases the indications for which this technique can be used. The ability to reduce the amount of bone removal that is required along with the angulation and size of the Sonic Flex retro tips offer additional and significant advantages.